Hey there and welcome back to my channel where we talk about all things virtual assistants. My name is Jessica Dawn Eden and I run my own virtual assistant and digital marketing business. Um, in this video series I've been asking loads of top... asking? Oh goodness me. I've been answering lots of top favourite questions from my Facebook group The Freedom VA which you're welcome to request to join. Um, however, in this video, it's something that's come to my mind that I remember I was struggling with and I want to talk about that. And that's boundaries and why you need to have them and what happens if you don't have them. So in the beginning, when you start your business, you are really happy to be available to your clients all hours, any day, Saturday, Sunday, message me, I'll fix it for you. And then when you have one client, that's okay. When you have three clients, it's manageable. When you have 10, it's driving you crazy. So it's really important that you put some boundaries in place. When can people contact you? How should they be contacting you? Um, when are you not going to respond? What days do you not work? You know, is there public holidays in your country? There, there is in mine and I don't work on those because my other half is home and so is my baby and I would like to play with them and have fun and maybe go out for the day. So what's really important though is that those boundaries start with you. So if you don't respect your time, don't expect anyone else to respect your time. So it's really important that you lead the way. So evenings, take your phone, put it away, you know, don't respond to client messages. If you've said, don't message me on Messenger, please use email um, or put your tasks into our project management tool. Then when they message you on Messenger, reply and say, hi, I'm really sorry, can you please not message me on Messenger, but send us an email on this address. Thank you so much. Um, so it starts with you. If you don't respect your own boundaries and if you kind of don't model that to people, then it's gonna be very hard for them to learn and um, to respect those as well. Heads up though, the clients that have been working with you for a long time and they got used to these kind of systems, they are really, really, really hard to untrain. So um, you might be banging your head against a brick wall that's not going to shift anywhere. That's my take on boundaries. Um, if you haven't got any right now and it's stressing you out and you've kind of built a business that you're not actually enjoying anymore, then I would strongly recommend that you go and go back to your contracts, look at what you promised in your contracts. What's your turnaround time? When did you say that you're working? Is it, you know, US business hours, European business hours? Then you don't need to reply on Saturdays and Sundays and you just need to let it go. I struggled with that. I lost two or three clients when I stopped responding to messages on Saturdays and Sundays and I refused to accept tasks on Sunday morning to be complete by Sunday evenings because this is my only time that I have um, to be with my family. So um, yeah, but I had to model that. I had to take the consequences um, and live with the fact that what was okay once is not okay now. My business has changed and that's not what they need. So we just have to go our separate ways. But that is my take on boundaries. Um, and if you have any more questions or there's something that you struggle with, then I would like to welcome you um, in the Freedom VA Facebook group so we can talk about it behind closed doors where nobody can see it. Um, if you are new to you know the virtual assistant world, um, but you know that this is really for you and you want to get started, but you need help, then check out my course, the VA Accelerator, where I take you from no business to a functioning business over the course of 12 weeks. Um, really exciting. You have to be working hard, you have to have the commitment to see it through, but if you do, then you will have everything in place for your business to rock and roll after that time period. Right, I'm gonna hop off now. This was the last of my videos today because I'm going dizzy and um, I will see you all in the Facebook group. Bye.